as they continue to climb up the table, we've been spending the week with our women's team asking whether they can win the title. Along with all the behind the scenes action from the team photo shoots, we also speak to two of our star players as they sign new deals. But first up, it's Tony Duggan. Scoring goals for fun, Tony Duggan has netted six goals in her last seven games. With City women fourth in the league and just three points away from leaders Chelsea, we sat down with the striker to talk about her incredible form. Yeah, they just seemed to be going in, but it was nice to see the one go in against Arsenal because we knew how much of a big game it was. Off the back of a Chelsea win as well, we knew we wanted to be in contention for the league and them two wins have probably defined our season so far. What do you put your form down to at the minute? I'm not sure. I was, I was really frustrated at the World Cup, obviously not getting on the score sheet. I'd have liked to have seen more of the ball at the World Cup than I did. So I've come back and I've wanted to put my stamp on this league, make a mark, prove that I can score goals. And, you know, my performances have shown that. I've come back with an eagerness to win. And obviously with the league in sight, there's nothing I'd love more than to come away with that silver. Have you got a tally in mind, goal tally? What, what would Tony Duggan be happy with now? <laughs> um, at the start of the season, I never set a goal tally ever. I think it puts more pressure on you. As a striker, you want to score anyway. And I expect to score. Um, I've scored six and six now, I think it is. So ideally, I'd like to score four and four in the next few home games. Um, that's probably my small target. But if I don't and we win the league, who cares? As long as we win it, then that's all that matters. Well, this weekend, we continue the defence of our Continental Cup trophy with a trip to Sunderland. A good time then for Jill Scott and Karen Bardsley to sign new deals, keeping them at the club until 2017. KB, congratulations staying at the club until 2017. You must be delighted. I am. I'm really excited. Uh, when you put it that way, it sounds like a really long time. <laughs> Obviously really pleased, I do realise that I'm not getting any younger, uh, there's a lot of fantastic young players coming through at Manchester City and other clubs so yeah just probably a little bit relieved to have another two years here. I think we've made a lot of great strides in the first two years that we've been here, you know um, obviously winning the Continental Cup last year was, was a massive um, stepping stone and I think we've got a fantastic opportunity ahead of us this season to do some, some big things and hopefully bring home some more silverware. The results are coming for us this second part of the season. So yeah, it's exciting times to be a Manchester City player and as I say, I'm just del delighted to be here with the girls for another two years. Finally, a break from training as earlier this week, the team lined up here at the Academy Stadium for their first full team photo shoot in the new kit. As always, we were on hand to capture the moments. Poser. Probably Tony or Steph. Or, yeah? Tony and Steph. No! <laughs> Next to beat it is bronze. Next to bronze is flint. Next to flint is bad. Everyone's understandably in a really good mood today, aren't they? The, the team is just doing fantastic. Yeah, of course. Uh, we've got a really good run and obviously the weather's beautiful. We've just had a really good training session. So I think everyone's in good spirit. Definite feeling that we're going to go all the way this year, get the title? I'd like to think so. I think in both, you know, not just the league. We've got the Continental Cup as well, which we've just got off to a really good start in. So maybe two trophies at the end of this season. There's a feeling of confidence because we've won six in, in six and we've, you know, we've played Chelsea and Arsenal who are, the, uh, who are in first and second. So we've got ourselves in the running. That doesn't mean we're going to win it. It just means that if we carry on playing the way that we are, then we stand a chance. Right, you're there. OK, next to McManus is Duggan. Duggan. Duggan! <laughs> so, pictures eventually taken. Attention now turns to Saturday's game in the Continental Cup. Don't forget, we'll have all the highlights on City TV. We'll see you then. It's hot now. 